Now that we know about data relationship in MongoDB and also schema and schema validation, let's move to CRUD operation in MongoDB one more time. And let's talk about other aspects of CRUD operation in MongoDB. So in the next few lectures, we are going to dive deeper into insert, update, read and delete operations in MongoDB. And let's start with inserting a document. We have already learned how to insert a document in a collection and for that we can use insert1 and insert many method. Now let's try to understand what is the ordered insertion in MongoDB and let's try to understand it with an example. So first of all an ordered insertion simply means that every document which you insert using insert many method that will be processed standalone. But if the insertion of one document fails it cancels the entire insertion operation from that point but it does not roll back the documents it has already inserted. So ordered insertion is applicable only to insert many method when we are trying to insert multiple documents in bulk and we do not have ordered insertion for insert many because there we are only inserting a single document. Now let's try to understand what do we mean by ordered insertion. So let's go to Mongo shell and here let's say I want to create a countries collection where I want to save the country code and country name and I want to use country code as the ID of that country. So for that I'm going to say db.countries.insert many. So here I'm using insert many method to insert multiple documents. Now currently we do not have this countries collection. So here if I type show collections command and if I press enter, you will see that currently we have three collections, orders, products and users, but we do not have this country's collection. But when we are going to execute this command, MongoDB is first going to create this collection in this eShopping database. And after that, it is going to insert the documents, which we are going to pass to this insert many. So here we are going to pass an array, a list of documents. Let's specify the first document. There I'm explicitly going to specify this underscore ID field. And let's say here the ID is IN and country is India or maybe instead of country I'll use name and name is India. In the same way let's also add two more documents. The second document is let's say the country is France and for that the ID is FR and the third country is UK. So the country code is UK and the name of the country is United Kingdom. Okay, let me go ahead and let me copy this command from here and let's paste it here. So if I run this command, a country's collection will be created and in that country's collection, these three documents will be inserted. And here you can see the inserted IDs of the document. So for the first document, basically when we are inserting the document, the index starts from zero. So at the zeroth index, we have a country with country code IN, where the underscore ID value is IN. So that's what we inserted. Then at index one, we have a country with country code FR. So that was the second document which we specified in the insert many command. And at the second index, we have a country with country code UK and the country name is United Kingdom. So when we use insert many command, each document is inserted one after the other, right? So each document here, it will be inserted one after the other in the same order in which we have specified it in the array which we pass to insert many method. Now let's go ahead and let's try to insert some more document. So I'll insert another country called Pakistan and for that the country code is PAK. Then I will again try to insert this country France where the country code is FR. And here for the third document let's say USA and here the name of the country is United States of America. All right. Now what will happen is if you see when we will try to insert these documents in the collection for this document, we will get an error. Why? Because for this document, we are specifying an ID with which there is already a document present in the country's collection. So let me go ahead and let me actually query the country's collection. For that, I'm going to use this find method on the country's collection. And you will see that there we have three documents and one of the documents where the country name is France, there we have the underscore ID value as FR. And 
if we run this command at this document we will get an error because with this country id with this underscore id value we already have a document so we have learned that no two documents in a collection can have the same underscore id value mongodb will not allow that the underscore id value is used by mongodb to uniquely identify each document in a collection so anyway let me try to insert these documents and let's see what happens so i'll paste that command here and if i press enter you will notice that we have got an error and what does this error say it says that there is a duplicate key in the collection and the error is for this document okay so here you can see the document at index 1 has error and what error do we have the underscore id duplicate key so there is already an underscore id value with this value fr and that's why when we are trying to insert the second document here it has thrown an error but if i go ahead and if i query the country's collection one more time you will see that this document where the country code is pak that has been inserted here even though this query when we run it it returned us an error but then also one of the documents in this case this first document in this insert many that has been inserted in the collection and that's why when we received the error that time also you will see that the inserted count is one that means one document was inserted when we run this command and after that document was inserted after that when mongodb tried to insert this document it threw an error because of duplicate underscore id field so this document was not inserted in the collection and after that we also have third document where the underscore id is usa so with this id we don't have any document in the collection but still this document was also not inserted so again at this line mongodb throwed an error and it terminated the insert process when we run this command first document was inserted when mongodb was trying to insert the second document there it found a duplicate underscore id value and mongodb immediately threw an error and it did not insert it this document and it also terminated other insert statements so other documents after this faulty document are also not inserted in the collection and this is called as ordered insertion an ordered insertion simply means that every document which you insert using insert many method that will be processed standalone but if the insertion of one document fails it cancels the entire insertion operation from that point so the insertion of this document failed because of duplicate underscore id value and after that all the insertions were terminated but the document which was already inserted mongodb does not roll back that document it is still present in the collection and this is the default behavior when we use insert many method and this is called as ordered insertion now it is possible to override the default behavior of ordered insertion so let's say what we want is only those documents which has some problem for example in this case this second document with this underscore id as fr this document had the problem because here we are specifying a duplicate underscore id value with this underscore id value we already have a document in the country's collection so this document will have a problem so only this document should not be inserted other documents which does not have any problem which has a unique underscore id value that should be inserted in the country's collection so we can also configure that and to configure that what we can do is to this insert many method the first argument is an array where we specify all the documents which we want to insert and then we can also specify a second argument the second argument is optional but using the second argument we can configure the insert many method and here one of the properties is ordered and when we set it to false that means it is not going to do ordered insertion it is going to do unordered insertion in ordered insertion if any document has a problem that document will not be inserted in the collection and after that if we have any document those documents will also not get inserted because the document where we have the problem from that point the insertion process will terminate so any document after that will not be inserted in the collection 
but when we set this order to false that means we want to do unordered insertion and in unordered insertion only those documents will not be inserted in the collection which has problem all other documents will be inserted in the collection and let me show you that so let's copy this command and before that let me change this country code of the first document to something else because we have already inserted that document here you see that document is already inserted so we don't want to insert it again and let's say the name of the country is Bangladesh but still in this list we have one document for which the country code already exists in the collection so here we have a document where the country code is FR and in this list also we are specifying a document where the country code is FR so this document will not be inserted in the collection but other two documents since they have a unique underscore ID they will be inserted in the collection because we have set the order to false so now we are going to do unordered insertion let me go ahead and let me clear the shell here and let's paste that command and now if I press enter you will see we have an error the error is at this document because here we have a duplicate underscore ID value so this document will have an error and it will not be inserted in the collection but if you see the inserted count it is 2 that means other two documents where this underscore ID is unique that has been inserted in the collection and the error is again the duplicate key error so basically we have an underscore ID value which is duplicate in the collection so that's why that document was not inserted so this is what ordered and unordered insertion is and let's also quickly verify if these two documents that means this country Bangladesh and this country USA is inserted in the collection or not if I go ahead and query the country's collection you'll see that the Bangladesh and USA it has been inserted in the collection so always keep in mind that the entire insertion operation will never roll back if something fails in case of ordered insertion if a document is already inserted and after that the other document has some issues it will throw an error but the previously inserted document will not be rolled back from the database it will not be removed from the collection in the same way for unordered collection also the documents which are already inserted in the database they will not be rolled back the document which has a problem it will throw an error and it will not be inserted in the collection but the documents which is already inserted they will not be removed back from the collection that will never happen so I hope now you understand what is ordered insertion and unordered insertion and you can do ordered and unordered insertion only for insert many for insert one you don't have this option because in insert one we are anyway going to insert a single document so there we don't need ordered insertion or unordered insertion this is all from this lecture if you have any questions then feel free to ask it thank you for listening and have a great day